What's happening, everybody? Y'all know what time it is, man. Yes, yes. So here we go, y'all. Recently made this purchase and got one of my dream dream toys, basically. You know, uh, it is a Glock, as you can see. So let's go ahead and... Uh, Bust it. And it is the Glock that takes the MOS plate adapter, which is your red dot. It did, it did come with it. This is the Glock 40. Infamous Glock 40, y'all. Just to give y'all a reference on this. You know what? I'm going to do that later on. Hold, hold on. Moving too fast, but I'm just so amped up and excited, but... As you can see, it comes with three magazines. It also comes with your cleaning brush and the cleaning rod that's right here. All right. Also comes with two back straps. I did reach out to Glock and see if I could get the four back straps they got. But they're currently out of stock right now. You know what I mean? So, but that's what it looks like, y'all. Y'all, I I have been waiting patiently for this thing. And it's finally here, y'all. It's empty. And this is what they call a long slide at Glock 40, y'all. Let me show y'all something. All right. I, I couldn't find no other, you know, tape measure, so I got my my fishing scale. It's a, it's a fishing scale. You know what I mean? You weigh, you weigh your fish with this. You catch you one of them big ones that's worthy to put on this thing right here. You know what I mean? So... It also has a tape measure. So this Glock 40, it comes with a, I believe it's a five inch, five or six inch barrel, but the slide is, I believe, nine inches. Yeah, about nine inches. So it's super duper long, yo. For real. So let's go ahead and take it down right quick. This is the barrel. Yeah, that's a six inch L. Six inch barrel. So I've been waiting patiently for this. I like I said, this is it has been Something I've been longing for for a minute and finally got a chance to get it, y'all. But, whew, yeah, we're going to have some videos coming up with this, man. So, be patient. It'll be there. It is a 10 millimeter. It's what they consider a bear gun. You're supposed to be able to take a bear, a deer, a elk down with this. Oh, I forgot to show y'all. So this is where optic mounts. You just remove these two screws and you mount your optic on there. Whether you need to use this plate, these plates or not. I forget which one of these is which, but you know what? I got an idea. I got an idea, y'all. I have an idea. Let me push this to the side right here right quick. Let me grab this over here. Look at here, y'all. We got us a box. I almost forgot all about this. 
I've been so amped up and excited with this Glock. So, I'm gonna give y'all two for one today. This is gonna be an unboxing now. We're gonna go ahead and unbox this. Turkey, this is it, right? I believe so. Uh, y'all hear Turkey. Turkey is running the camera for us today. We appreciate your services, Turkey. So, yep, there it is, y'all. I got this from some folks over there. Where they at? Virginia, Carolina, somewhere. But PSA, y'all. PSA. Man. I get to use that sticker. I need some more though. But yep, there it is, y'all. There it is. Got me another one. Got me a Vortex Venom. Red dot. Which is going on to this Glock. It is a 3MOA. Decided to go with the 3MOA this time to check it out. Since both of the Canics, we have actually have the 6MOA. Man. Let's open it up. And I really, 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 really haven't had a chance to do a uh, review on these Venoms or this uh, Vortex Venom Optic I guess I could try to squeeze it in on this one I hope y'all don't mind but one of the things that I really really like about this Vortex Venom is that one check that out it's neatly packaged it's inserted into the phone, cut out, and on top of that, it's covered in plastic still. I mean, I could pull this whole thing out and it ain't gonna go nowhere, you know? But you go ahead and bust this open right quick. But that's, that's like a big deal for me. It's like, Maybe not to most folks, but like I said, to me it is. So, and there it is, y'all. The three MOA. I'm gonna leave this in this package right now. What is this? Oh, there you go. Now the battery vortex. If y'all are watching this, the battery, y'all package it so well. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and use this they package this thing so well you will need a razor blade because uh oh you see that it's well packaged y'all it's well packaged pick this up right quick there it is alright last time I had I had problems with that thing so and here we go, the adjustment tool, the little cover. And here go the screws. We'll just wave those off right now. Come back to the Glock. I'm gonna remove the slide from the Glock. I don't have to take it all the way down, but I, I'm going to. All right, let's see, let's see. What do we have here? It looks like one of those. It looks like one of these right here, like a star. Taking my jiggy.
and now we'll, we'll just remove this top plate and that top plate is actually O5 it's got O5 on it let me go ahead and open this up There it is. It's 05, y'all. So, we'll just lay 05 down. Boom, perfect. Boom. Oh, another thing that I I love about these uh, Vortex, this Vortex Venom, is the rear sight. So, you can actually use your co-witness with this thing look at it all right let me see i'm gonna go ahead and use those screws they do have a little blue loctite on them but guess what we're gonna add a little bit more a little bit more don't hurt the show, you know. Just a little bit more. This is a Glock 40, so. It will need it. All right. Looks like we have our top plate on there and uh, we'll go ahead and oh man that, that boy looks good what do you think Turk? how would look smooth like butter smooth like butter not butter what's wrong with butter I like butter just can't believe you said butter having having a little time with this thing so Glock always looks out man they already made sure they put blue Loctite on there for you so you just drop it on in and I'm gonna go ahead and see how far this thing comes down on there I don't know if that's that's lengthy enough for me man it's barely like yeah that's barely cool. yeah let's see what uh vortex got going on over here y'all bear with us oh yeah that's a difference ain't it indeed it is All right, all right. Yeah, it's the same thing. Nope, this one a little bit bigger. All right, so let's see how far this screw goes down. That's a little bit better. Y'all see that? That's a lot better. Definitely. Yeah, so I wish it, I wish I had some uh, lock washers. Uh, I don't have them right now, but I will get some. And if Turkey reminds me, I'll show them to y'all. So for those that that could use it, yeah, y'all can. Y'all will benefit from it because you don't have to worry about the thing sliding off and on but we'll go ahead and finish this up wrap this up right quick i didn't mean to take this long to put on some optics y'all and uh we'll get it on down the road 
and like so. Sharing is caring, y'all. Sharing is caring. Just like that. Now all I'm gonna have to do is go get some ammo. Oh man, that is not good, y'all. It does not fit. <laughs> it does not thread in. Yeah, that sucks, y'all. Well, we're now going to use the the screws that came with the Glock. There it is. Oh, it probably would help if I put the battery in. probably saying we can't see it we can't see it I know it how about now can you see it now yeah you can see it now you can see that bad boy line too it's lined up y'all so I'm really glad that We got the zone here, and I'm just making sure it's tight and snug. Let me go ahead and put this thing together. Well, that's it, y'all. Here's the new addition to our family. It is my, like I said, it has been my dream to own this. And I'm glad it's finally here. You know what I mean? So. Let's clear y'all. Turn this dot off. 
Yeah, the only thing I got now is I don't know how to feel about this this rear sight because I got my co-witness on my venom. So it's what it is, man. Put the cover back on there. But yeah. There it is, y'all. I don't like I don't really like to run mine with the cover. I just like it the way it is. Uh, so be ready. Anyway. On that note, child, that's going to be it. Here's the Glock 40 with the Vortex Venom installed. We really appreciate your support. All the new subscribers. We welcome y'all over here. You know, we just trying to learn and move forward with life, be at peace, you know what I mean, and be ready at the same time, to keep from getting ready, anyway, with all that being said, we hope y'all also enjoyed the gardening portion of the channel, and some of the automotive work, and that, that great cycle. Hope us up because it's almost a week. Okay, not almost a week. Two, three days. And that's because of parts. Anyway, enough of my babbling. Remember, you can fix it too. And on that note, y'all, till next time. Peace. Alright, yeah, I know some of y'all was like in a hurry to really get this video done and over with. And we would have been done and over with, with it, but unfortunately we gotta redo it because look what we found. This is the actual, man. It's the Glock MOS screws for the Vortex. So, let's go ahead and uh, remove the slide. Take this thing apart all over again right quick. And there it is, just like that. Easy peasy, Louisy. So, drop that on there. Now we'll open this up. And before we even drop it on there, let's go ahead and try it out to make sure it screws on there. Or threads on there. And it does. I believe it does. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it, it does. Perfect. So now, this is a do-over. We gotta roll it over and get some blue Loctite on it. Yeah, like so. We're not gonna share with this one but we is gonna get it wet we just gonna get it wet y'all and it came with this Oh man, here we go. Let me get the other one started. Look 
Like his own now, coach. So, with the Vortex Venom, you would have to use these optic plates that come with your Glock 40. Otherwise, if you have the Vortex Viper, I believe you could just run it straight down on top of the slide without using the plates. Oh yeah, that's a lot more secure right there. Let's go ahead and uh, slide the barrel back on. And I do have the mag out. Now it just fell. There it is. Now let's see. Oh yeah. I don't know if you ever see it. Yeah, you can see it. There you go right there, that, yeah. So, with all that being said and done, y'all, again, remember, you can fix it too. And on that note, y'all, appreciate y'all's support. Till next time.